How you doing? How you doing, man? I'm very good. It's good. You to seem be. happy today. You don't seem very angry. Yeah, it's a it's a good night. Yeah, it's good night. I'm doing okay. Yeah. So you're a Harold and Kumar fan? Huge Harold and Kumar fan. Big fan. We're, we have a debate. First or second one? Which one do you like better? First or second one? Uh, I like the first one. It's the original. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's like going home. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> And what about the films do you think, um, you know, not only does it have a mainstream following, but it has such a cult following. So many people, like, you know, everybody has this DVD. What do you think about it attracts so many people? I don't know. I think, you know, it's funny because the, the first one didn't do so well, and it, but I think everybody feel like, they felt like they discovered it, you know, like in, in, on DVD and they got passed it along to friends. And so something about it really, like, has that sort of, like, it's, it's, it, it means a lot of different things to different people, I think. But I, I think that... Um, I don't know, people really gravitate towards like underdog characters, you know? And do you, um, have you met either of the actors before, John Cho or Kyle Pond? Uh, yeah, yeah, I've talked to both of them and, uh, you know, I talked to them for the first film. Um, just, you know, I, I always have like just questions about the movie and I'm like, just want to know like, you know, what were they, you know, what it's like being like, you know, the Indian American and Korean American protagonist of this major Hollywood film. So, I, 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 I think they're, they've done really awesome things with their career since then. But it's always cool to see them coming back to the franchise, so it's cool. It's in 3D. Are you excited for that? Um, I am looking forward to all the crazy things they throw at me in the 3D. Yeah. And the uh, San Diego Film Festival, how was that whole experience for you? San Diego was awesome. I, I enjoy going to that every year. Um, I never miss it, and uh, it's good times. And you did karaoke. We saw you doing karaoke. Yeah, I'm never going to live that down. Everyone <laughs> seems like everybody saw that or heard about it or something. And uh, the take on me, you brought it back. Uh, yeah, I brought it, you know, I was doing the take on me, my ode to the 80s. And uh, I don't know, I, I don't know, I, I, give, me the, give me the mic and I'll rock it, you know. <laughs> exactly. And then lastly, um, you know, your blog keeps blowing up all the time. What is some of the stuff that, um, you know, inspires you to write? What are some of the things going on right now that just really inspire you? Um... Well, I mean, there's always, you, you know, we always have to deal with things that are going on in the media um, and uh, in the news that, that to deal with prejudice and racism, you know, so I'll always have to write about that, I feel like. Things are getting better, but I'm always reminded of things that are going wrong. Uh, but it's also like the achievements in Hollywood and politics and, and beyond. I mean, um, it's, uh, movies like Harold and Kumar where, you know, you, you, get, you get really offbeat sort of heroes out of it. Um, that's always encouraging, I think. All right, for sure. Well, you have an amazing time inside, man. We hope you enjoy the third one as much as you did the first two. Thanks, man.